Hey guys, Warrior here, and welcome back to Dying Light 2, episode 79. Where today we will be focusing on. I'm pressing on the wrong buttons. On the Veronica story, main story quest. I don't know how long this is gonna take, but hey, let's go. Actually, wait, I wanna reset the day. Because it's not too long before it's night time. And don't want that to be the case and sleep again. And now we'll have the full day all to ourselves. No need to be stressed out by being chased by a bunch of virals and volatiles and all those things. Okay, uh, exit is a busy way. Let me turn my light on. There we go. Okay, so in the last episode, Veronica actually called us and told us to meet her at the dam. Yet yeah, the thing is telling us to go over here. I don't know if there's a glitch or a bug. I don't think that's supposed to happen unless I'm mistaken. But then, I guess it has to be like a bug or something because then why isn't this happening? Uh, just to wait for the voices to coming because the audio is a bit busted. There we go. I'm going to shove some of those a peek. What's up? Hey, what you got for me? Ooh, goodies. Some goodies. Close to 300. What garbage do I have that could be very valuable to you? Uh, nothing at this moment in time. How much of them not? How much? How many of my friends can I actually carry here? Uh, 15 and 24. So basically, I can buy you out. If I have the cash for all of it. Well, how much do you charge for these? Let me just sell all my valuables real quick. And to my bank, I can afford all three of these. Excellent. Mine, mine, and mine. How about these? Mm, those are so expensive. They really up the prices of gear, huh? Dang! That is insane. Now we're looking for Veronica Ryan, and she used to be the doctor too. She was the doctor here. We actually met her a long, long time ago. I'm trying to find the area where she was. Oh, she's right over here. Hey, Barney. Long time no see. Yeah, long time no see, Barney. Hello, Barney. What brings you down? How's things going? How's life? Better? Now that the PK finally stopped bothering us. I'm even thinking of starting my own business. I know a bit about weapon design. Ooh. I could start making and selling them. Sounds good. How's Sophie doing? And uh, how's Sophie doing? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's major news. She's the big boss now. <laughs> I'm sure she is. After all that happened, folks finally realized we needed a real leader. I'd say things have turned out the way they always should have been. Well, good for her. And for all of old Villador. Okay, have you seen Dr. Veronica Ryan around? I'm looking for Dr. Veronica Ryan. You're not the only one, man. What do you mean? The good doctor's in trouble. And, uh, weird kind of trouble. You see, a group of renegades appeared in old Villador. First, we braced ourselves for another battle. But they didn't attack the bazaar. Just ask for Dr. Ryan. Of course, we didn't tell them where she is. And where is Veronica? <laughs> you can tell me, right? In a hideout. Vincenzo and a few of her people are protecting her there. But the less people know about that place, the safer she is. Where is it, Barney? If the renegades are hunting Veronica, a few people may not be enough. You just can't walk away from a fight, can you? The building is north of Quarry End, Courtesan Rose Street. But you didn't hear it from me. Why didn't he help Vincenzo? Hey, I'll just say thank you, go. Thanks for the info. I'll go and give him a hand. Of course, see, I'm the one always itching for a fight. Anyway, good luck, man. Alright, cool. We got places to be!
Play it on. And close the doors. There you go. There we go. Alrighty. Let's go say hi to Veronica Ryan. Up we go. Up we go. So the renegades are already after, huh? Huh? How far are we? We still gotta go quite a ways. Keep running and keep climbing. Let's go. Uh, ah. Keep going. Parkour music's kicking in here. Sorry about that. Did I, did I just jump up over a, a, a friendly? My bad. I know the fighting music's here. Did I? Or what was that? I don't know who and what happened, but. I'm on my way. Okay, that luckily worked out. Back at the hospital. Man, oh wait, 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 hello. Are right, they? I'm on if I do. Oh, get others here and more flowers here. I'm good, good. And the place we need to go is over here. Let's see if we boost ourselves up. We should be able to make the flight. Maybe. We'll see. So it's over here, huh? We have one voice message. Well, hello, Renegades! Get out! Get out! Yeah. Didn't quite work out, but that's alright. Two shots, he's done. These weapons I have are really OP. Get that! Quite squirming and die! You got anything for me? No? Your buddy does. What's it here? More stuff. More stuff I could use. What's in the fridge? Some rice. And some actual honey. Let's go. Um, I was about to say we're, we're going to go down and there's a massive hole in the floor. Okay, what's in here? Some wearing. Or a throwback to a few episodes ago, some writing, as I called it back then. <laughs> By accident. Okay, anything else down here? Oh no, that does not sound good. I got a lot of pick this thing. I love renegades. Get over here! You're back! Who next? Get over here! Down you go. What you got for me? Are you? Come on, another thing. Uh, 
else to loot while I'm here? No? No, okay, we're good. Lock pick medium. Okay, well... We could just tell them that it's me. But would they, would they even know who I am? Wait. Aiden. Vincenzo! Thank God. Where's Veronica? She managed to escape. I need to find her. Do you know where she is now? No. But we can try to contact her. Veronica? Veronica? Are you safe? Veronica? Ah, shit. Something's not right. Yes. I'm safe. Are you? Oh, I am now. There is someone who needs to speak to you. Hey, Dr. Ryan, I'm Aiden. I know that you're being hunted by the renegades. Hurry, Aiden. More renegades may be here any minute. Frank told me you worked for the GRE. I need access to the GRE database in the observatory. I, I have a GRE key. A GRE access key? That's what I've been told. You think you can... Let me. I'll be in a small building near the dam, not far from the observatory. Okay, um, Hello? Be careful, Aiden. The place is soaked in chemicals. I will. Thanks for the heads up, Vincenzo. Thank okay. you. I'm lucky you showed up. Man, you could be alright. Well. Thank you. You could be alright, man? Dude is beaten up, man. Bitchy, what is Poor Vincenzo. I don't know where I want you messages, but that's fine. We well, gotta go. Another room that I haven't checked out yet. Or am I mistaken? I'm mistaken. Up we go. Huh? Where'd you come from? Get back! <laughs> I can't speak. My weapons are just nuts. Okay, gotta meet her. I heard that line was in the when they were on the walkie-talkie. I think one of the lines bugged out and played when they weren't supposed to play. point that we can go to? Here she is. So she's over here. Alright, let's shorten that journey from 1.5 kilometers. Oh my word. Thank goodness for fast travel. Oh yeah, yeah. Flight, right? I don't know. There's the house we, the safe house we claimed in the last episode. Uh, okay, there's 130 meters to go. Going through the branches and trees. <laughs> I don't know what they had. 
in the middle of the tree, we should be okay. Up we go! I need to land. Okay, can we grapple upwards? Pull ourselves up here. There we go. And go! Yeah. That area is so bright. My word. Veronica, you are below me, actually. Uh, far below me. We'd cross paths sooner or later. You patched up Barney, right? He whimpered like a baby as soon as he saw the needle. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from an idiot? Why are you risking so much? Uh, oh, don't trust her. Tell, don't tell her everything. Let's trust her. Let's go full on trust. I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. Had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? A mid-level doctor only. Oh, okay, so she wasn't high enough to... Uh, high rank enough to... Know everything. Okay. Why are you interested in this place? Why are you helping me? Are you looking for something in the database as well? Aiden, those vaults contain my organization's biggest secrets. I almost died because I was a part of it. I need to know what they were hiding. What if you don't like what you discover? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Okay. Why were you hiding in the bazaar? How did a GRE doctor wind up at the bazaar? By not letting anyone know I was a GRE doctor. After the revolution, the GRE were blamed for the disaster. Personnel were rounded up and executed people used revenge to relieve the pain doesn't matter if it doesn't work what happened happened now i'm someone else okay how are we getting inside how are you planning to get us inside the observatory look there's a security tunnel into the complex it was locked up years ago give me the key and Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay, then come with me. I have something to show you. Okay. Oh, well, she moved fast. Mamma mia, Marie. you're already almost 100 meters away from me. Yay, yay, yay. Well, at least I don't know that actually follow her and walk slowly behind her and all that. Ooh, watch out for the yellow stuff. Don't want to be in the chemicals. Oh my word. Oh. Why are we here? See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. The, the THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. 
Well, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one for you. Okay, well, I mean, I had to go there, so why, why ask why just me? They're both yellow, so... Let's do it. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one, too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B-Block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. Okay. So we won't be affected by the chemicals. Let's go! Okay. We are on a time, but we have... Less than a minute to get there. We gotta move! Go, 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 go. Don't block me, Branch. We gotta go. When that time it runs out, we'll start to die. That, what the? No! That's not what I wanted to do. Where do I go? Over, over, over here. Go, 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 go. 15 seconds. <laughs> Emergency protocol initiated. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. Okay, so we have 15 seconds to get to that one. I'll tell you to also get up here at the same time. Like, okay, that's a bit insane. Okay, go! Ah! Alright, we're good. Let's keep going. All the way up there. Oh, it's a grappling moment. It's a grappling moment. Oh, uh, it might, might, might be too short on that. I'll try that again. There we go. Alright, jump! Grapple! Launch! There we go! We're good. Okay. Now up to here? Yes! Oh, what's here? What's in the bag? It's a bow! Arrows aim full of the bow! What damage is that? One, three, two. Uh, I have a bow already. Uh, my bow is way better than that one. Okay, oh. Well, what is this? Damage-wise? Trash. Okay. Hey, we found the hatch. Let's get in here, shall we? Hey, Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. How do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once. Long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. We have 15 minutes to get back into the light. We should be more than fine. We have immunity boosters. What's to do here? Veronica, I have a horde that's infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Well, it isn't. Don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. What do you mean yeah, I can't get through, Aiden? Do you not know the weapon you have? We'll just wreck them all, warn zombie, at a time, without any issues. Sort it. Excellent. Let me just loot all these boys real quick. Hello. <laughs> Next, please. 
Where we were? Not really. Well, I don't know how to get to that crystal that was in the nest there, but that's okay. Oh, I hear a lot of zombies. And the place is sucked with chemicals too. Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of them here. Time to wakey! Let's go! Hey, boy, you gotta wake up! Hey, get off of me! Check if there's stuff for us. Oh, I see a box. Oh, a medium lock. And let's see, go there. Okay, guns. That weapon is bad, but I'll take this in the shoes. Anything else? That's the door we're supposed to go through. And. Easy lock. Okay. Ah, 
I can't come out. Come yeah. uh. There we go. Anything here for us? Oh, I see a big red outline. Oh, it's a goon. Get over here! Yeah, they turn it out and does. Let's get you guys out of the way so I can deal with this goon. And they're basically one on one situation. Or try to. Yeah. Get away, get away. Now! Got him. He's down. There's some sleepers in the way, the way back. Quit sleeping! <laughs> Anything else or can I go up? I can go up. I didn't see a ladder. Yes, here it is. Open that. There's a here. Some wiring bracelets and a whole bunch of other things. Ooh, a bunch of lockers to open. What's in you? Sunday shoes. What's in you? Like a cigarettes. More cigarettes. More cigarettes. Even more cigarettes. And more cigarettes. These people love smoking. And more cigarettes, more cigarettes. Nothing but cigarettes. What did the other guy brought his shoes? Everyone else has brought packs of cigarettes. Gee, what's good? Can't open this door either. Ah, here's the thing we gotta turn on the power. Ooh! We gotta take this somewhere, don't we? But where's the starting point for it, though? There we go. I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. This place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Let's see. I think it will fuse. I'm checking. Do something. Quick. Please. Yeah. Don't, Don't worry. worry. I'll fix it. Don't, <laughs> Don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Relax. I'm not going to leave you. Because everyone's fears if you're stuck in an elevator, I wouldn't be when I want to be there too, but just calm down. Oh my God. Please. Please let me out. Calm down, Veronica! Right, power's back, you alright? Veronica? I'll meet uh, you by the elevators. Yeah, I'll be there shortly. I saw this door here and I want to check it out. <laughs> she was, I know, she must be afraid of elevators. She's possibly cla uh, claustrophobic, if I said that correctly. It's like me, you ain't getting me near an edge without a railing. No chance.
especially when we're higher up on like a floor, floor or something like that. No worries. No, 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 no. All right, Veronica, I'm coming. I knew that door will be open now because the power's back on. It is. I would at to hear. The door for the elevator's still closed. Veronica, you're right. Are you alright? See? Told you everything would work out. Just get in. Was there stuff back there? I couldn't do it. Where the database is, it's trying to calm her down. It's trying to calm her down. You've always been claustrophobic. Seriously? For over ten years. So what happened then? Abe, for God's sake, can we not talk about this right now? Okay, I'll ask you where the database is. Uh, the database. Where is it? Just give me a moment. Below us. Even farther than this? Another six floors down. I'll just try to help her to focus on something else and talk. This is pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the Observatory. Then the virus came, and that was the end. Okay, so what happened in the end? So, what happened here, in the end? Well, the GRE lost control of the situation, and it all went to hell. Everything collapsed. From what I know, the scientists at first barricaded themselves inside. But soon, conditions in here were as bad as they were in the city. So some of them quietly slipped out. And those who stayed are the ones you got rid of earlier. So this was a military complex? So the military ran this place before the GRE? Yes. It used to be a Cold War command bunker. Cold War? A period in the last century. Wars back then were fought on a grander scale. It wasn't just about day-to-day -day matters like having enough water, UV lamps, and food scraps. In a way, though, it was just like things are now. People lived every day in constant fear. Interesting story. That's quite the story. They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Something out. Later, out of the elevator now. If we have electricity here, we could use it to power up the whole floor. Uh, yes, yes, because we can do the the take the wires and power them up. But I first gotta open this here real quick. Here we go. See what we have in here. Ooh. Sneakers and maintenance materials. Oh, a whole bunch of things. All the word map. All the old word. All the world with manual. Uh, right. No power on this floor. So right. This thing here. Yeah, yeah, I'll get going. Okay, so we got 19 meters to pull in total. Um. Well, that's really the only way. There's no way we'd be able to do this while pulling that thing, right? No, I, I, I can't move any closer. I'll have to let go of the wire. I'll just have to let it go. I guess I have to drop down, right? 
Go down! No, down! I want down! Is the room clear? Room is clear. What's in here? Uh, keep them up. It's a hard lock. Oh, 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 there it is. There's the sweet spot. Ah, uh, don't, don't do that. Don't glitch on me because I'm on the right spot now. Come on. Hospital braces. Military med kit. What's in here? As Borfin. Uh, oh wait, that's stuff down there I can grab. Some weights. Uh, more Asporfin. This place loves its Asporfin. Okay, uh, cigarettes, Asporfin again. Cheesy whiskey. More Asporfin. More cigarettes. Some blades. Some electrical parts. Man, these guys in their cigarettes and their ass porphin. God damn me, I guess I now know what's in the cigarettes. Sheesh. Who can open his door? Well, there we go. Door's open. Is this an unclearable loot? Seems to be that way. Okay, yeah. Uh... What's in this room? Uh, uh, oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Am I supposed to get myself in, into the vent? Then go somewhere. And door is currently locked. But there is stuff in there, I think. Lights everywhere. Let's see. What's in here? What's in the trash? Some rags. We got here rags and cigarettes. I should have this place. Man, this is an underground confined place. So many people are smoking. Mamma mia. There we go. Okay. Turn it like this. Mm -hmm. make it. What's in here? Uh, oh, more rags and more rags. Anything else? Oh, we gotta go up. Oh. I'm gonna stand on top of this thing. Climb here. I'll see if I can get, 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 get to it. Crawling in the vents. Hey! Oh! Hey, I found where the power needs to go. Just plug this cable in. It might work. Okay, so now you gotta take the cable up from this door. Yes, there we go. From right here now, we have enough line to carry it over to this one. There we go. Everything's working. All good. Smart move. Rerouting the circuit. Yeah, saved my life a few times. Veronica, should we get going? Yes. Let's get this over with and then get out of here. This way. 
Okay. The main computer is there. You'll finally know what happened to your sister. She's all I have. What about your parents? I don't remember them. Just her. We... We were a good team. Without her, it's like, uh... God, I don't know. You don't know what? Well... I don't really know who I am. We're all better people than we were 15 years ago. We all got... lost. It's here. Okay, it's there. One second, I'm gonna do this real quick. Oh, oh, oh! So close. There we go. So close to getting it one shot. It's happened a couple of times. Anything else for me? There's a place I can not climb. I can climb it, sure. Do I need to? Well, let's see what Veronica is for first. It's locked again. Good girl. The terminal is inactive. The security system isolated this area. Uh, I guess I'm up. I've got an idea. Try to find the officer's room. There's a security desk. We could try to operate the door locks from there. You should be able to use your GRE key on it. You sure know a lot about this building. Please, just insert the key and select emergency unlock on the screen. I'll explain everything to you when we're done. Oh, so you have secrets, huh? Oh, I wonder. You say you were here once. Yet you know exactly what to do, huh? I wasn't here already. Mm, very suspicious. But okay, I mean... Uh, boop. Yeah, but we may have another problem. I'm stuck here. I need to find a way out. Can I help you somehow? I don't think so. Just stay where you are. Okay. Just stay where you are, Veronica. I will um, try to get my own way out of here. After I managed to open this chest and break all my lockpicks on it. Oh, now the memories are coming back of breaking lockpicks and that uh, one lock and dying like one. I don't think it was on video, but I broke like 50 lockpicks on a very hard lock. And dying like one on the police van. On the highway in the tunnel somewhere. It was at the end of the highway somewhere. It was a police van. And it was a very hard lock and I think it was literally like 50 plus lockpicks that I broke on the thing. Just trying to figure it out. My word. The things you remember sometimes are the things that annoy you the most. <laughs> uh, okay. What? Oh! Hello, uh, zombies. You did. You did. You did. Okay, anyone with any loot? Anything? We have another hard lock to open. Uh, why is it always on the right side? It's like always over here, isn't it? Oh, there goes another lock break. Is it? Wait, what? Did, did, did I add a spotlight over here? Hmm. Oh, oh, there, there you are. I'm so close. No. Yep. There we go. Okay, we found some soldier cargo pants and a DIY grenade. Anything in here? Nah. Zip. Zero. Okay, uh, military 
Thank you. Excellent. Next time when we come through with the uh, the PK playthrough, I'm gonna have to think all the other options and remember what options I options I chose. She's remember this time I trusted her. Next time I'll pick I don't trust her and don't tell her everything. Dr. Veronica Ryan, Director, Field Laboratories Department. Only okay. oh, level GRE doctor my ass. Seems to be Veronica's office. You weren't honest with me, Veronica. Who's that boy? Maybe her son? Aid. A funny thing. Seems there was another Veronica Ryan. Director, Field Labs Department. I was going to tell you. Why are you helping me? Are you working with Waltz? Waltz? No, never. Even back then, I didn't. Waltz had his own research team. But you knew about the experiments, how they used kids. Me and my sister. That's why I'm here, Aiden. I... I cannot forget what we did here. That we let you down. All those kids in pain and no cure to show for it. Cure? We were five, for fuck's sake. Small children showed natural immunity to the virus. We saw a correlation between age, brain development, and infection severity. That's why they were experimenting on you. The GRE, the world, needed you. You seemed our only hope. I'm sorry. Was it even worth it? Was it worth it? I mean, did you even come close to a cure? We were close. But the virus... It finally reached the complex. Were you involved in those tests? So, were you involved in those experiments? No. The tests on children were all performed at a laboratory. Here we were gathering data and compiling research. I was here when it all happened. Team members began to turn, and things quickly spiraled out of control, one by one. We were locked inside, hiding, sneaking around through those dark corridors and ventilation shafts. My son, he was here with me. Paul, he was five back then too. What happened to your son? What happened to him? I managed to find the shaft leading to the main entrance. I told Paul to wait for me. I kissed him. And I told him to wait until I made sure the entrance was safe. He clung to me. Didn't want to let me go. When I came back for him, he was gone. I was only away for 15 minutes. I spent the next week looking for him. And then the rest of my life crying. I should have known. He was a kid. Scared. Alone. I'm sorry. You were trying to take him out of here. How could you know? Anyway. We all have our own stories of the past. Let's concentrate on what happens next. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Director. Man, it is sad, but still. Should have chosen we could can't trust her. Oh well. Uh, there was a drawer that I saw that we didn't loot while I was crawling the vents. Here it is. Ah, uh, great. More ass warfare. At least this guy wants some sort of something to drink. Gee, what's good? Uh, she went this away, this away to the door that she can now open. So, I'm going in. Hope you find what you've been looking for. All the GRE's data is in there, Aiden. I can't see squat. 
tolerance to the substance. Most tests performed. Exemplary results. I know we can't see it because I've got a costume on, but the markings on his arm. Not that he was supposed to be looking at, but we've got a costume on, so we can't see it. Just to give you some clarification of what was going on. He was looking at his marks, and those are the flashbacks. Alright, let's go... 
Let's go about for about Mia. Search for Mia. Is that your sister? Yes. Nothing. Impossible. She was there with me. <sighs> I'm searching. Sorry, Aiden. Records show no patients named Mia. God! It's impossible. Okay, what about Waltz? Waltz. Checking. One record. Clinical studies. Substance 1354. Study abandoned. All patients discharged from the center. Go through all the names. Uh, patient discharged. Were all of them? Yes. Damn it. No inform where they ended up. Or about this substance, uh, 1354 or something? I'm sorry, Aiden. There's more. The substance was also tested on some infected at GRE facilities across the city. To no avail. The project was run and supervised from X-13. It was eventually shut down, as was X-13 itself. Is there anything more about this X-13? In here? I doubt it. But I heard about it. X-13 was a hub of GRE operations. And the substance, you know what it is? There were so many tests and clinical studies, Aiden. Let me search the database for the research data. Something's wrong. What do you mean? It says a procedure's been initiated. Another procedure? I'm looking... Lots of data. Started, then paused... 11 years ago. Resumed a few days ago in X-10. There's also a map. <laughs> Several locations are marked, including the observatory. What the hell does it all mean? I have no idea. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Infected? They must be here somewhere. How many gates? They must have followed us. There's no time. Hurry, take the key, hide yourself somewhere, and lock yourself in. I'll deal with them. Aiden, we don't know how many there are. I'll handle it. Run that gates, huh? Okay. We can be sneaky. We can take them out quietly. Be quiet. That's one down. I do apologize. Things are, are a bit dark. Especially when the light's off. I can't turn it on right now because if I do, they will see me. Which way are you looking? You're not looking at me. Come here. Dead, dead, dead. Okay, dead. Don't you dare turn around, buddy. Regions! There's another guy. He's looking that way. Dead. Okay, anyone else I'll deal with with the light on. Thing is, I can turn off the lock, uh, the the uh, uh, white balance lock and the exposure lock, but if I do, things are gonna get weird. And, uh. and that might mess up the brightness, causing the video to look 
worse than it is right now. Why did I pick that up? I was, um, uh, Molotov, so that, that's actually okay. Uh, anything else? Weapons that are absolutely trash. This one's purple. It is also bad, but it's a grenade. I'll take it. Uh, that'll work. And there was stuff up here that I saw when we ran for our lives. Uh, anything that we can loot though? The answer is a yes. Drawer. What do we have here? More ass porphin and a bracelet. Uh, more of that. Don't need that. Another drawer. Uh, hey. Cigarette and uh, jewelry. Okay, I'm gonna tell Veronica everything's alright. Veronica? You alright? Yes, but I have bad news. These locations on the GRE system, they appear to be targets. Targets for missile strikes. Missile strikes? What are you talking about? The failsafe protocol. We don't have much time. Listen, this marks Riverend and Garrison. That's in the central loop. People live there. You have to warn Frank. Okay. Okay, I will. Hey, Frank? Frank, your neighborhood is marked on some tactical map. You have to tell people to evacuate. Come on. No time to explain. Just clear everyone out of there, Frank. Shit. Okay. Just wait here. I'll try to get through to them from above and take them out. You're safe here. More renegades, well they know I'm in here. So no time for stealth. It's time to go psycho. Oh yeah? You want an autograph? Oh, really? Are you? <laughs> that didn't work out quite well. I really don't like this. Oh, where are you Where'd you go now? Why, why are you trapped? Where did you go? Stop attacking me. Good luck, that. Squash. Where'd you go now? Why'd you lock yourself in a room with your claustrophobic? Are you serious? That didn't work. Veronica? Veronica? I think it's safe now, but we have to get going. Veronica? Hi, Veronica. There we go. Oh. I go all the way up here again, climbing TV screens again. They're off now and all that. But. Ay, 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 Veronica. I'm gonna come for you. You should have stayed there where you are. Relax. Uh oh. Oh, man, dang it. Wait. That's not quite what I planned. But this works. Wow. Okay, I've never actually done that before. So, hey, I'm glad it works. You there? Veronica! Where are you, Veronica? Oh, you Veronica, what have you done here? You find this door? Door doesn't even have a handle. Uh, Veronica! Veronica! This door just has, has a handle. And a medical med kit behind this thing. Okay, great. Uh, Veronica? Veronica? Talk to me. I am Gary. I'm sorry. I felt trapped in there. Okay. Where are you? I had 
headed towards the elevators. Veronica? What's happening? Someone's here. Oh, no. No, no, no! Veronica! She's here. That's her radio. Find her. Waltz! I'm supposed to go straight. Our footsteps is leading this way. Waltz is here. Come on, Brian, the door open. Come on! Pull! Oh, Veronica. I'm coming! Stuff here for me to loot. Now's the time. And quickly just grab everything.
Digging you out from under the rubble and carrying you here on my back. A small thank you would be nice. You understand, Luan. I... You what? I, um... I killed Veronica. What? I killed her. And not only that, I'm turning. I saw Veronica's body. It was torn as if by a volatile. You couldn't... Walter's experiment turned me into a monster. It was me. <clears throat> Walter's experiments. Back then in the hospital, there was nothing in the GRE database about me. But about the drug Walter was giving us, it had the greatest effect on me. I have to leave. I'm a threat to everyone. Walter told me that Mia's dead. I have to get away from here. I'm a threat if I stay to... Not to everyone. What if he lied to you? And Mia's alive. And even if not, you didn't kill Veronica Aiden. That wasn't you. I repeat, that was not you. If this transformation is because of Waltz, then we're going to make him fix it. Got it? I'll help you. How? Waltz created the inhibitors. He must know how to counter their effects. Who was that? Come on. Probably another building collapse. Another building collapsing? Not the one we're in, right? Oh my god. <sighs> the Butcher. He's finishing what he started 11 years ago. It's Walt. He used the key, and that's when this all started. What are you talking about? Dylan didn't want Waltz getting the GRE key. He knew the whole city would be at risk. Waltz took the key from Veronica and escaped. Apparently he needs it for something else. Do you see now? You have to stop him. Him and Williams. No matter what. One. I can't control when I turn. Any moment now, I can... When you feel something happening, just get to a UV light. I can't stop them alone, Aiden. Okay. Okay, let's get him. Now you're talking like the Aiden I know. Frank's taking Juan and Matt to the stronghold. He wants to meet with the Butcher. What? I had the same reaction. But he says that after the bombing, Williams contacted him and that he wants to talk. Has Frank lost his mind? That's why I'm going to cover their idiotic asses. You go to the fisheye. Maybe you can still talk Frank out of this stupid idea. If that doesn't work, I won't be far. Frank, are you kidding me? Nobody can know about Veronica. Remember, I know it wasn't you who did that. But Jack, 
The peacekeepers? They won't give a shit. They can't stop us. They won't. New story quest. The breakthrough. This whole area, it just... Oh my god. French. French. Frank, do you copy? So area is gone. Like there is their whole rubble and all in front of us there. Just gone. Nothing but dust. Whoa, this is thick. Oh, whoa. It's so thick, it's covering the sunlight. Wait, what does that mean for down below us? Oh, I don't know what that means for us now. We gotta get out of this place. We gotta get out of here. Someone's in trouble up ahead. Well, why do I have my katana? I'm out there weapon and broke. What is this? How is it? What is it? Like I said, it's nighttime out here. What? That's a violent. That, that person just turned. Get back! Get back! We gotta get out of here. All the people still that they were stuck under these clouds of dust. They turned. We gotta get out of here. We gotta go. Is that mission part of the, our, our mission or is the Veronica mission over? The Veronica mission's over. We gotta go. Are we out of the clouds now? Take me this whole area here. It's not just covered in that dust permanently. Well, dang. There's two icons of this. First there. The chapter two mission. What is this? It looks like the, the TF2 is icon over here. Or TF2. Why is it TF2? Is it the Shin 2? That's over here. Oh dang. We gotta be over at the fish eye now. You know what? That's perfect. Let's just fast travel to that area there. Man! Wow, that was nuts! Veronica mission took so long! But hey, we did it. And he's done. I would like to get to the bed now. I'm gonna stay here. I think in the next episode on we are literally a few hundred meters away. Just over a hundred actually. Meters away from our next mission that we have to do which is... Breakthrough? The Breakthrough, yes. That is our next mission. I'm still waiting on a fortune teller. I have to find this other car while I'm looting stuff. So, I'm waiting for it to happen. If we never end up doing it, well, then that's that. I mean, we've done a lot of other missions already. I forgot what you gotta check the missions you've already done. Uh, 
Oh well, that is that man. What a long episode. I didn't want to just cut a mission in half. With the Nightrunners it was a different thing. Did to go somewhere first. But now well. What's done is done. Alright, so we'll focus on the breakthrough mission in the next episode. So if you guys didn't see the first episode or the previous episode of Dying Light 2, you guys can go to the beginning of the video. There will be two codes popping up there. You can click on those if you're interested. There's also two links in the description. One link will take you to the Dying Light 2 playlist. The other one will take you to my website. If you are interested, they will all be in the very bottom at the description. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, share it if you really liked it. Comment, subscribe if you wish. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.